sudden it's busy, busy. They must be gonna have something over there. Yeah. I don't know what we're waiting on. I think they're uh, waiting on me and Kathy to drive down the road. They heard we were here. So uh, all of a sudden everybody, as far down as you can see, they blocked the roads off. Um, we just came by here a while ago and there was nobody here and we went in the museum and come out and all these people waiting to see us. I got my incognito costume on. Now these police throwing candy out. Very good. Man from it from our RV park. Look at all these people now. And there's our. This the ones at the RV park welcoming us. Candy Parade. Look at him walking the doggies. Don't know what to do about that. <laughs> well, looks like it's political and candy. Politicians and candy. <laughs> I don't know how long this thing's got to go, but I think I've had it. Valley for your communication needs. How well, far down this parade goes, ending or not. Animal control. Remembering all about these exhibit. Okay. I don't think I think we will ever get out of it. Now.
one of the drops and the easier waterfront areas were completely obliterated. The main force of local tsunamis was directed westward, away from the town. Most of our region itself was spared heavy air damage. However, five brutal minutes of shaking left a profound mark on the community. During the earthquake, uh, those and crop fires to the other ferocious buildings. And that burst to the same fire that just was set upon itself. Spent a lot of time building these little exhibits. Man, I guess if I was a good narrator, I would uh, go through the exhibits and tell everybody what they mean. North America's largest earthquake. Like nine one one. Make yourself at home, babe. <laughs> Have a seat and rock around. Don't sit in the chairs. Oh. She's mad at me. <laughs> okay, babe. Don't pull the trigger. Eight foot gun. One boat's destroyed. All these people. God. Yep. Ninety foot high wave. Man. Looking now. Craziness. So I'm hooking up on my remote. Yeah, another beautiful day in Valdez. I <laughs> think we're going to cut this visit short and leave out tomorrow. I'm going to tell the RV people and then go eat some fish and chips, I hope. Yeah, yeah. Sounds good to me. Where are we turning? Right here? Right here. Pioneer Drive. Hmm. And I'll just pull up real close. Right here. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, where are we going in the morning now? <laughs> Homer. Homer! I don't think we'll make it one day. Homer! Huh. Which is okay. Tomorrow's mm. supposed to be crappy everywhere in the state, but Tuesday it's supposed to be sunny in Homer. No murmur. Chase the sun. Uh, let me just cut right through here. Where are you going? Right here to Fish and Chips. That's where we're going, isn't it? Oh, I thought you meant that place over there. No, this is Old Town Burger and Fish and Chips. No, I didn't know you could go Fish and Chips. There's my baby. I got halibut. She's got halibut. Salad. Big, big, big grocery store at Safeway.
Oh. I know she wants some prepackaged stuff. What you got there, babe? Zuchi, Zuchi. Um. This is a big, big store for downtown Valdez, isn't it? 